Last year alone, over 40 million people visited Las Vegas. And with over 300 hotels, you can bet that if you asked a thousand people to name their list of top five hotels in Las Vegas, you'd probably get 999 different lists. But after spending way too much time looking through an endless amount of reviews on Booking.com, TripAdvisor, Kayak.com, and YouTube reviews, we've put together a list of five of the highest rated hotels in Sin City. So let's get started. Kicking things off at number five is the Bellagio. For decades, the Bellagio has been one of Las Vegas's most popular hotels. The 1,200 dancing fountains on the 8.5-acre lake in front of the hotel are famous in their own right, while the design of the hotel is supposed to imitate an Italian villa, with a beautiful indoor botanical garden where butterflies flutter around, which changes seasonally. Because it's a must-see location, there can be long lines in the lobby, but it's well worth the wait in the iconic hotel. Rooms are quite high-tech, and even the drapes can be controlled electronically. The bathrooms have gorgeous marble floors, soaking tubs with separate glass showers and double sinks. There are five different pools to choose from and a courtyard with a Mediterranean style, as well as loungers, a deck, and cabanas. The hotel's spa features a sauna, a salon, a men's barbershop, as well as poolside massages. The fitness center is decked out with loads of equipment that is really spacious. Art lovers will appreciate the Gallery of Fine Art, which has rotating exhibits as well as Cirque du Soleil performances five nights a week. There are a handful of on-site boutiques like Gucci and Chanel to meet your shopping needs, and of course, the hotel's casino is a big draw. There are a number of restaurants and bars on site, like the Bellagio Cafe, as well as Spago by Wolfgang Puck, Hyde Bar, and a buffet that's rumored to be the best on the Strip, complete with unlimited sparkling wine or Bloody Marys. At number four is Caesars Palace. When you think of classic Las Vegas hotels, this Roman-themed hotel and casino comes to mind. It stood the test of time, as it's been around since 1966. It's a huge resort with six different towers and almost 4,000 rooms. But don't worry, though it's an older hotel, it's been newly renovated, especially the Coliseum Tower, which was just opened in 2023. And when you think about big superstars with residencies, they're usually performing at Caesars Palace Coliseum. Check out our video titled Biggest and Best Concerts and Residencies in Las Vegas for 2024 for more details. World-renowned DJs play nightly at the Caesars Omnia nightclub, and the hotel is home to a massive pool complex called the Garden of the Gods that has eight different pools. They feature mosaics, cabanas, and huge Roman columns, as well as one with an 18-foot waterfall, one with a swim-up blackjack table, and the Venus Pool Club, which provides private cabanas, couches, and various food and drink options with an entrance fee. Caesars Palace also has a gigantic casino with a 14,000-square-foot poker room, which is one of the biggest in Las Vegas. Foodies will love the hotel because it has one of the biggest buffets on the Strip, with more than 500 items like lump crab avocado toast, truffle deviled eggs, and red velvet pancakes. There's a Chinese restaurant, Rao's, a New York Italian restaurant with a bocce court, a Southwestern restaurant ran by Bobby Flay, a steakhouse, a Japanese restaurant, and a French restaurant with two Michelin star chefs. The Qua Baths and Spa is one of the biggest spas on the Strip at 50,000 square feet, with 35 massage studios and 51 treatment rooms, Roman baths, Laconium steam baths, tea loungers, a hair salon, and a snowing ice room. If you're looking for a good mixture of the biggest and the best, then Caesars Palace is the spot. Sitting comfortably at number three is the Waldorf Astoria. If you're looking for a place to escape all of the lights and sounds and people that can make Sin City terribly overstimulating, then Waldorf Astoria is the best choice. It's an upscale hotel focused on wellness that got a major refresh in 2018. Instead of being located on the 23rd floor, the hotel lobby is now located on the first floor, and its Asian designs have been replaced with Art Deco, including Calicata Gold Italian Marble. 
The rooms are designed to feel more homey, which makes them more comfortable. Actually, a lot of the Waldorf's designs strive for comfort rather than flashy, eye-catching gimmicks. You won't find casinos or loud music here, which is a good thing for those looking for a little R&R. On the eighth floor, you'll find the pool area, which features two heated whirlpools, a plunge pool, and two pools with lounge chairs as well as cabanas that can be rented and poolside service during business hours. The hotel also has a 27,000 square foot spa that offers hydrotherapy, a range of massages and treatments, and there's even a Turkish hamam. For getting around the strip, the Waldorf provides guests with free transportation within a radius of two miles around the hotel. And even the food is high-end, with a fancy French restaurant that features a Michelin star chef as well as the Zen Kitchen with Asian themes and pool cafe with casual American foods. But one of the standout features is the tea lounge on the 23rd floor, where a traditional afternoon tea service is provided and you can enjoy beautiful views with floor-to-ceiling windows. Taking the silver at number two, we have the Venetian Resort. The Venetian is a huge tribute to Venice and Italy, complete with a replica of St. Mark's Square and gondola rides. It's not just a gimmicky resort, however. There's a lot of entertainment and luxury to be had at the Venetian. For starters, the standard room size is 650 square feet, which makes them some of the biggest in Las Vegas. And they all have big bathrooms with soaking tubs, as well as separate living rooms with sleeper sofas. And because of its prime location, you're close to all sorts of entertainment. But if you're looking for entertainment, you really don't have to look beyond the resort. In the St. Mark's Square replica, you can find street performances and living statues, and Sands Theatre features musicals and concerts. If you're looking for adult-oriented fun, the Tao Beach Club, which is an adults-only pool, has topless friendly nights and DJs. And the replica of Rialto Bridge leads directly to the famous Madame Tussauds Wax Museum. There are an impressive 10 different pools, plus several whirlpools, and you have the option to use the pools at the neighboring Palazzo also. The resort's Canyon Ranch Spa is world-renowned and has a number of services like Hydra Spa, Finnish Sauna, the Igloo and Showers, as well as other treatments and massages. The fitness center is quite impressive as well, with lots of strength and cardio equipment, spinning and yoga classes, and a huge 40-foot climbing wall. The casino is something you've likely seen in shows or movies, with frescoes on the ceiling, marble floors, loads of slot machines, a big poker room, and more. You won't go hungry either, because the resort has an incredible 20 different restaurants on site, as well as 24-hour room service and a food court. Some of the upscale restaurants are from big-name chefs like Wolfgang Puck, Thomas Keller, and Emeril Lagasse, and there's an emphasis on Italian food at the resort, which makes sense with its Venetian themes. If you're looking for a resort with lots of adult-oriented fun, with kid-friendly options, and loads of entertainment, then the Venetian resort is where it's at. And taking the gold medal at number one is Win Las Vegas. Win Las Vegas has earned a spot on many best hotels in Las Vegas' lists, and for good reason. From their casino, fountains, indoor koi pond, and number of temperature-controlled pools, which include both a topless optional pool as well as a family-friendly option, an 18-hole par 70 golf course, 13 restaurants, and a spa with loads of treatment options, it offers tons of activities and amenities to make your stay exciting and luxurious. When it comes to entertainment, there's an excellent nightclub where big-name DJs, comedians, and musicians come to play and provide nightly entertainment, and Le Rev, which is the hotel's Cirque du Soleil-style show. If you're in need of retail therapy, there are several boutiques and luxury shops like Hermes and Chanel to be found at Wynn. In 2022, Wynn got a $200 million renovation and it now features windows from floor to ceiling that face the Strip, as well as mountain views, because it's on the northern section of the Strip. Guests in tower suites get additional amenities, like private check-ins and pools, and the lobby looks like something out of Willy Wonka's fantasies, with 110,000 flowers sculpted into depictions of carousels and hot air balloons. 
mosaics made from tiles, and wrought iron accents. When you step into the Wynn Las Vegas, you're immediately greeted by a delectable posh setting. And that level of service and finery doesn't change throughout your whole stay. Well, folks, that's it. Please let us know in the comments section what you thought about our list. And feel free to share with everyone your personal favorites. Thanks for watching and safe travels.